Hey guys, welcome back to my video of Tony's phone collection. Today we're doing an unboxing of the phones I picked up. Um, yeah, I know some of these were on Macari and on eBay. Oh, this is gonna be a mess. I hate this packaging, to be honest with you. There it is. Let me run and grab my vacuum real quick. Vacuum this up. Alright, here's the first one. This is a boxed Sanyo Katana, which I already have a few of these, but I don't have one that's in a box. So the reason I picked this one up. Here it is. Not too bad shape, just a few scratches on it. It's probably dead. It is. LCD looks good. Let's see if there's a battery to cover off the uh, charging port fell off. It feels like there's a battery, so there it is. There's the model. Let's go ahead and move on to the next one here. This box looks a little crushed, so we shall see what happens with this one. That was easy. This one I bought off McCarty. Camera, but price it wasn't too bad though. There it is. No battery, I can tell the way it feels. SGH F three thirty. No SIM card. Looks to be in pretty good shape. Missing the volume rocker here. I want to say it's probably unclipped up here. Is that, yeah, looks like it's unclipped there. But it's missing the volume rocker. Seems to be in decent shape. Slider feels a little, a little iffy or some kind of noise. Hmm. There's that one. We'll move on to the next one here. And I will be doing the update video sometime. I just got to finish going through them. I got a lot of them charged up and found batteries, so. And let's see here. There's two of these. They were on eBay. There's still more on their posted. If you look these up, the Nokia 5230 Neuron. These two are both brand new in the box. So um, I'll pick these up. These were not too badly priced, to be honest, for both of them together. So there's those. And then we got one more left. We'll see what we got here. We got a micro USB, USB A cable, JBL. Another cable. It's another micro USB. USB A, and then we have a proprietary LG charger. 
Uh, starting out, we have an LG. I think I just got one of these, actually. Yep, AT&T, uh, G, oh no, let's see, CE110. Does have a SIM card. It's probably dead. Oh, the charger does fit this, so that explains a lot. Here's another LG model. LG 441G. This is on a straight talk or track phone. LCD looks good. It is dead. Oh, no, there it is. Two of them got charged. Here is a Samsung. This one's about to die, as you can tell. SGH A877. No SIM card. And uh, no micro SD card either. This is a slider phone. Does have a screen protector of some sorts put on it. It is dead, and this one is, that one is dying as well. Here those two. Here's an iPhone case. Looks to be 12, 13, or 14 Pro Max, maybe. A Max West. Never heard of this one. And I don't see the back cover where it comes off, if it even comes off. It doesn't feel like there's a battery in there, so it has to. Maybe it just comes off here. I don't know. Well, we'll mess it up here. It is right there. I say it has to be somewhere around here. There's a the model number. No SIM, no SD. It is a dual SIM device. Designed in the USA and made in China. Interesting. And then here we have a few other phones. Here is a Samsung with a shattered screen. Model number J320P. No SIM, no SD, no battery. Completely shattered. AMOLED panel is cracked underneath. You can kind of see the blackish color behind it. Probably not worth fixing on that one. Here we have two iPhone 5Cs with parts, green one and a white one. Let's see, the water indicator is red on this one and white on that one. I'm gonna assume they're probably iCloud locked. There is the screens, one's cracked, one's not. Looks like the uh, delaminating up here in the top on this one. It might just be a scratch at the right angle. Nah, it's delaminating, I think. But, there's an unboxing for this one. Oh, I guess there's a battery for the uh, J. Alright, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Stay tuned for the next one.